What's up everybody, welcome back to Grab, my name is Tom. On this video, we're gonna check out the three new flavors of Grenade Energy. Last time I tried this product, I was not impressed. It was the first release and it just wasn't up to standard. I'm hoping that Grenade have stepped up the game to bring the products in line with the rest of their product range. Stick around to the end of this video where I pick my favorite flavor and then field test that during a day at work. Let's get on with this video. So Grenade have released three new flavors for the Grenade Energy. First being the Cherry Bomb flavor, Bird Alive, which is a strawberry and blueberry flavor, and Son of a Beach, which is a tropical flavor. Each can is boasting natural caffeine at 155 milligrams, zero sugar, BCAAs, electrolytes, and vitamins all in one can. Slight variant is Cherry Bomb comes in at 11 calories, Son of a Beach comes in at the lowest with four calories, and Buried Alive comes in at only five calories. You can find out more information and benefits of the product on their website. I'm here to taste test and field test, so let's get on with this video. First one I'm gonna start with is the Cherry Bomb. This thing sounds exciting. Sour cherry flavor just intrigues me a little bit. Wow, that one certainly has a punchy flavor to it. It has that sweet cherry tangpastic flavor. So yeah, that is really powerful, really sweet, and really refreshing on the palate as well. Sometimes you can have that bitter sourness that really makes your teeth sing. It doesn't have that. Yeah, very impressed. Good start on the Cherry Bomb flavor. Next, I'm gonna go with the Son of a Beach, which is the tropical flavor. The tropical flavor is probably very close to the original flavor. If you were gonna get some sort of like pina colada, it has that kind of taste to it, where you're picking up those tropical fruit flavors. So yeah, the flavor isn't bad. They have stepped it up above what the original tasted like. It does have that extra kick, but it's just not as far up as I would personally want it. If you're looking for a more milder flavor, then this could be that nice in between. Finally, let's get on with looking at the Buried Alive flavor. Straight away, the first thing that I'm going to is strawberry laces. This tastes like those strawberry laces that you would pick up from your corner shop that you'd run to as a kid. Bringing back a lot of memories, to be fair, just from the first few sips. Again, it's not quite as sweet and sour as the cherry bomb. But yeah, it definitely has a distinct flavor. It is definitely the middle ground between some of a beach flavor and the cherry bomb. Like I say, if you like strawberry laces or you like strawberry refreshing smooth drink, this is definitely going to be the product for yourself. I'm very impressed of how they've managed to step up the game from the first iteration of this product because I had pretty much written it off after the first product. I wasn't enthused to come out and try this product. I don't know why I doubted them. But let's get on with picking my favorite flavor of these three new grenade energy drinks so that we can then go out and field test this to see how it helps me through my day at work and if the product lives up to what it boasts on the can. Just because it tastes good doesn't always mean that it's gonna live up to expectation. My favorite flavor is the Cherry Bomb. This is the sour cherry flavor. So the aim of the next part of the video is to check out this product, see how it helps me through my day at work, and then provide some insight into what I thought, if it helped, if it didn't help, and my final reviews at the end. If you want an insight into what I do day to day, stick around to check that out. If you're happy with my taste testing, I will catch you guys on the next video. Welcome to the van, guys. It's now 9.38 um, in the morning. I've already been to one club um, already in Manchester. I'd had a sort of a reasonable breakfast and a pint of water before I'd set off, so I didn't feel like I needed to set the energy first thing in the morning. I'm now at my second club um, here in the Liverpool area, so I thought now would be a good time just to take the energy to allow me to see how it works and if it's effective through my day. I have the cherry bomb flavor, which was my favorite from the three um, that we sampled. I'm probably gonna drink about half of it. I don't wanna drink the whole can straight away. damn that still tastes good so my expectation is that it's going to take around about 30 minutes for me to sort of feel any sort of effects of the natural caffeine in there just to give me that perk up a little bit fingers crossed it's got everything i need to help me through the day let's get on with it
we're about three hours after starting drinking the can. Very impressed that my energy levels are maintained at a pretty high level. I could start to feel them tilling off a little bit now, but it is lunchtime, so I'm going to have the rest of this can with my lunch, and hopefully that'll power me through the rest of the shift. I've um, only got a couple more clubs to do, and then I'll be back. Very impressed. It's done a good job. I'll give you my final thoughts after this. Cheers. into my day job hope you found that interesting overall i'm very satisfied with the product i liked my energy levels throughout the day i didn't feel like there was any sudden crash i could feel the caffeine wearing out um, but luckily i'd only taken half the can and then used the other half at lunch so that gave me that pick up after lunch yeah very impressive hope you guys found it interesting with these three new flavors i'm very impressed with how far they've managed to improve the product from the first iteration if you've not seen my previous video go check that out just to see the two differences on there till then i'll see you on the next one peace